Hello and welcome to the physics course. On this page, you're going to find lots of information on how to set up your physics main lesson. It's going to include the different subject areas within physics that we're going to cover, as well as a number of resources that we're using. I share with you some excerpts from a book on how to set up your physics main lesson for the day, as well as the main lesson block that's going to span throughout the years. Now, a lot of these subtopic areas are going to be revisited year after year, in a more in-depth version as you proceed through fifth grade all the way up to ninth grade. These lessons are experiential, they are demonstrations, and they cover five subtopic areas within physics. We have acoustics to start out with, with some really simple demonstrations. All of the demonstrations on this page are usually pretty short. They include some directions on how to set up the demonstration, and then we perform the demonstration. Included are also my notes on the demonstration, the materials that we used, and some notes on how we found those different experiments. Following acoustics, we have optics, and I've included a lot of living books within each of these subtopic areas, but they can be used as resources for the parent or the teacher. In our homeschool, we do read aloud a lot of those resources, and we do enjoy picture books and biographies as well. If you're sticking to a more authentic Waldorf approach, then those resources can be used as information for the teacher or the parent. Previewed are some of the demonstrations and experiments that you can expect in each of these five subtopic areas, but more are going to be added monthly. While some demonstrations do need special equipment, for the most part, especially for grades 5, 6, and 7, a lot of the demonstrations use materials that you can easily find around your home or at local vendors and hardware stores. Following optics, we have thermodynamics, and we have used some additional resources from a few science vendors for this subsection. After that, we have electricity and magnetism, which includes a lot of additional kits and books and resources. A lot of these demonstrations are fairly short, but they are extremely profound, so I highly recommend that you add in these demonstrations along with your physics lessons. In a Waldorf-inspired physics main lesson block, you'll have one demonstration to go along with each lesson. The last topic in our physics main lesson block is on mechanics, force, and motion. You're going to find examples and demonstrations along with other videos in this section. You can also find examples of a main lesson book and the entries that go along with each lesson on the course page.